Alright then everyone, hello and welcome back to Brave New World Blindfolded. So, after doing some digging and a lot more digging, I managed to figure out that the Phoenix Cave is reasonably doable. It's a logistical mess, but it's doable. But of course that means I'm going to need to vet my Ice Guard away into a Flame Guard right now because, you know, it's the Fire Dungeon, protection from ice isn't going to help me a whole lot. So... And she gas mute for some reason, whatever. So, of course, I'm betting it away right now. Thankfully, I can just bet it right back when I'm done with this, and I need to go like Narsh or somewhere that I can. Uh, where I need more ice guards, so it's nice how I can kind of just go back and forth whenever I feel like it. So, but yeah, right now, Flame Guard wanted. And of course, I'll probably be explaining. Or afterwards, because this mini segment is over. Well, time to enter the Phoenix Cave. So, I've got my party set up. I planned for a while, actually. I definitely want my characters in this specific uh, order here. The order I'm going to put them in, like C, G, S, C, E, S. Because if my characters are not in the right order, that can have pretty bad impacts at some points. Obviously. So, yeah, I'm gonna find a So yeah, I know some people really don't like the idea of re-equipping, like, sw switching all the equipment between parties in a multi-party dungeon, but I don't know, I never played that way, I never really used that restriction or feel the urge to start using that restriction. Switch to the other team. Besides, I'm undermanned and understaffed, so I need every piece of equipment I can get doing its work, so... Alright, have this party step on the switch first. Glad to see they didn't get into an encounter. Go up. So basically, this party right... So I am going to be switching equipment during the dungeon. This party right now is equipped with... Semi-junk. They're just basically equipped with enough to get them through one battle right now, because that saves me an entire equipment swap that I'd have to otherwise do, and I mean, it's the first battle of the dungeon, I'm going left next. If, it, if I mess it up, it's probably not a big deal. Okay, preemptive or... It's gotta be preemptive or side attack, given the fact that I couldn't pause right away. So this is... Gosh, I didn't get an encounter with this party last time, so I'm a little frazzled. This is Gao. And thankfully the rage I want to use is the one right at the top left of his rage menu. Adamantite. Immune to thunder, which is great for those uh, sea flower guys. And Cyclonic does a number on everything, and when it hits. <coughs> and what else? I swear there was something else, but I forget now. Well, safe is nice, I guess, but that wasn't what I was thinking of. Alright. So, I want Cyan to use Mind Blow first off. There's three enemies, so it's not an Aquila. One, two. Okay, witches, apparently. Best case scenario is mind Cyan Mind Blows a Revenant, but... Honestly, it's pretty nice to deplete anything in here of its MP. So... Alright. Since so this should be the next one to come up, so I'll just hold the button in preparation. That way, uh, it'll lock in an X, an H bomb, or rather blackjack, I suppose, if uh, he's rigged to get a victory this time around. So, one, two, three. Hopefully, that wasn't too fast. I think that was probably too fast. I mean, another mind blow isn't going to be the death of me or anything, but. Yep, I was right. Yeah, I was too slow there. I might get choke pop now. Wasn't paying enough attention. Is Gao dead? Because I'm not hearing any Gao. Phoenix down. I think. Oh gosh, I don't know where Gao is. I think he's right one one, one below Cyan. There's some weird things with targeting and of items in 
pincer inside attacks though, so I'm kinda worried. Dang it, too slow again. Oh, what? Things are dying, apparently. Did I win? <laughs> Do I win now? Okie doke. Uh Oh wow, Setsu was dead too. That's pretty close, actually. If Setsu and Gao were dead. Whatever. Close is not dead. In fact, Science probably the least tanky of the group. Skills. Cyan. Magic. Cure. Boy, Cyan needs to use a lot of MP to cover what Celeste can do so much more easily. Uh, left and up still. Hopefully that should be the only encounter with this group. I mean, I guess it's technically possible I could get another one, but... Hasn't happened yet. I mean, there's a first time for everything, but... Right... Down and right... Alright, good. Alright, now first things first. I have Stray on Gao right now, because he's right next to gaining a level a sort of the dungeon. He doesn't always, but he sometimes does. So I've got to remove that from him. Just make sure my cursor's in the right spot. I like it that item sends uh, the cursor back to the top of the menu for no reason, because that's a lifesaver. Skills. Gao. Espers. It sounds like the Esther Revenge dude to me. De equip it. And now send the curse back to the top. Just to make sure nothing wonky happens with it. Skills. Seven. Espers. Yeah, that sounds like the Esper Menu. Actually, I should have done my normal check for that instead. Hooray. So Seven should have Stray now, nothing sounded weird about that, so... Time to go! This team's gotta cover a lot of distance before the other team can get to the save point. Kinda weird how that works, but... The other team has to also cover a lot of distance before it gets to the save point, and they're probably the riskier one, so it's unfortunate that I have to do them second, but... I mean, I guess I could've done them first, but I wouldn't be able to get across the, uh the one spot where I need to get across the jumpy thing with the stone rock things. You know what I mean, right? Around this rock. There's the spike noise I wanted to hear. Oops. Actually, it's not a bad idea after all. Skills, less magic, cure... Spikes aren't that bad. It's definitely worth doing just stepping over it as opposed to being dumb and actually playing the gimmick of dungeon because then I have to go very far out of my way in comparison. One, two. Now I go down into the next room. Now I should be in the next room, the lava room, which means that I have slightly more dangerous encounters in here and I've got to be a little bit more in the ball, especially with Edgar. Thankfully, it's really easy to tell the difference between Edgar and Sabin. Alright, I went up there, so I'm going to be going left next. Alright, I heard a tentacle, but the jury's still out on which battle it is from that. Mist doesn't tell me anything. I'll just skip turns for now. Raise, so that must be double revenant, double witch. Best case scenario is that hit Edgar, worst case scenario is it hit Celeste. But at least Savin's covering somewhat. So scroll down to the chainsaw, because I want to use the chainsaw. I mean, that's kind of how it works in most RPGs, but. Seven, you just keep the group alive, just in case Celeste got poisoned or something. Celeste, you keep attacking. And I'm pretty sure that was a counterattack because the uh, attack was on the very far left of the screen. 
One thing I've noticed about Windows 10, it actually improves my stereo audio a little bit, which helps a little. <laughs> Random source of help, but, you know, there you go. Actually, Windows 10 is just improving the audio in general, really. I wasn't expecting something like that, but I'll sure take it, because I know it definitely records a little bit better, too. It sounds a little bit... I hear a little bit less buzzing in the background. Like, I always hear a buzzing in my older recordings, but not in my newer ones, so... Phoenix down, nobody died. Celeste did not get zombified. Celeste did, however, get poisoned. So, she must have gotten hit by that race there. I think. Well, I guess she could have been petrified, too. Whatever, doesn't matter. Get out of there, I don't want to be doing stuff. Skills, less magic, cure... That didn't take much. Seven must have mantered pretty much right before the battle ended, so let's probably just got hit by a poison tick or something. Left. I actually forget, and I forgot on my last run where I messed up something dumb with the Esper, so I'm going up next. Which I didn't keep because that's just such a boring blooper, it's not worth it. Alright. No information from that. Oh, this is actually Edgar first. Didn't expect that. Uh, there are sea flowers. One thing really weird that I didn't notice until now. Enemy counterattacks happen on the left side of the screen. They sound as if they're hitting themselves with the counterattack, and it's been throwing me off the entire game, and I haven't noticed until just recently. Alright, so now noise blasting, because I know that was a feeler, so... Oh, that's not good. I should probably have Celeste reaching herself, then. Uh, right. Two down, reaching yourself. That mantra will keep her alive, at least. So close to the start of the fight that I'm just gonna... Oh, there must be an Ouroboros, too. So I know which encounter this is. I'd better get... Oh, this is seven. What? I'd better get Edgar chainsawing that thing so it's not left at the end of the battle. Which isn't good because I had to spend that turn getting wave cannoned. They can knock themselves off of confusion pretty quickly, so... Uh, oh, well, I just inputted Mantra for Slash. That's useful, I guess. There's one enemy out of the way. Slash so should hopefully take care of number two. Oh shoot! Now I know why I was confused. All right, Edgar. Edgar should get to confusing them already. Now hopefully Sless is still okay. Go for it, Sless. Murder that guy. He should be low already, because I hit him at the start of the battle, I'm pretty sure. So he should be dead now. Missed with feeler, but I think she might be poisoned already if I'm not mistaken, so that doesn't help me a whole lot. I mean it saves 200 damage, but I think all they did was uh, use the uh, magical attacks on themselves, but just to be sure, you know. Also, I'm going to be hitting one with Celeste, so I might as well not knock that guy off permanently. Dead. Just one enemy left, and he's unconfused, that's for sure. Celeste may, may or may not make it to the end of the fight. Okay, now she probably will, because Sabin, I'm pretty sure, is still at full. So, she should be pretty solid right now. There we go. I don't know which way I'm going next, but it doesn't really matter. I'm an idiot. That's gonna be fun. Save item. Uh. As expected. Go back in. Skills less. Okay. 
That sounds like your magic menu, so actually I might have lucked out. Alright, so now let's continue on moving. I should be very close to the top left right now, because I was not expecting two encounters on that stretch of movement there, so... Pretty sure it's down and then right, but I wasn't 100% sure, so... And no reason to risk it. There's my jumpy platforms. Back down. Back to the left. Alright, making some progress, but... I can't really feel secure until I start making progress with the other team. Because that means they're probably equipped properly, probably haven't made any mistakes, and I'm not liable to mess up their battle strategy so much. Okay. I actually should have been more careful there, because the battle's due fairly soon. But I've probably made it where I intend to go at this point, so... Yeah, so I get stuck in this little notch next to the entrance of the room here. The nice part of this area is that I can just back up the way I came in, essentially. It's always nice when I can do that. Up. Oh, wow. Battle there. Better than a battle on the set beforehand. That's... or, well, two sets beforehand. Seven. As usual, who goes first? Hit stuff. What is that? What is that indicative of again? Uh... That's Firestorm from the, uh, Revenants, I think. If I didn't call that properly, well, that's not so good, but hopefully things will work out for the better. Oh, there's an Ouro... Great. Joker plus, uh, Ouroboros, I guess. Well, that means Celeste is worthless. Whatever. I'll have her attack the, uh, Joker next time. Thankfully, Sabin's keeping the party alive through my mistakes, probably, so... He's really good for areas... Oh. I've seen this before in my, uh... in the segment that I edited just recently. An enemy died when I had a targeting on it, and... I ended up getting stuck in the other menu. So yeah, fixing that this time around. Lots of that. Alright, so now hopefully Edgar should ch chainsaw the other one, and Slash should finish off the Joker, and then all is over with. There we go. I want lots of encounters with this team, because I want Edgar to level twice before the Red Dragon, so he has so hopefully enough HP to survive a thousand needles. Otherwise it gets a lot harder, because I don't have a character I can keep rock solid some of the time. Ooh. Because if Edgar has over a thousand HP, it'll be a lot harder for the Red Dragon to kill him. Um. Oh, what am I doing? I'm an idiot. No one died. I kind of didn't expect a death. Skills less magic cure. Yeah, as I expected, not even a whole lot of damage. The battles in here honestly aren't all that bad, it's just the Red Dragon who's a pain in the butt. Although I do have to be extremely prepared for these battles, so... I guess bad is relative. Solid strategy over luck, I suppose, which isn't easy, it's just, uh... It's just more likely to succeed, which I'm glad about because I want likely to succeed. Alright, so I hopefully made it to the bottom right. Left one, all the way up to the top. That's probably a good sign, actually. Uh, that took a while. Okay, so yeah, that's a back attack, and with sea flowers, no less. So that's not so great. Or maybe it's a... no, it can't be a side attack. What? I'm getting confused now for some reason. Either way, there's Sea Flower, so Noise Blaster is a good move. Oh cool, 
that guy died. How nice of him. Alright, they've probably been... Oops. Uh-oh. That's not so good for Celeste. She was probably already not doing incredibly great. But if she survived, this mantra should be for up a little bit. Not to full, because Savin's probably hurt us well at this point. Oh, she's not dead. Oh, well, now she's on po Maybe poisoned? I don't know, there's a lot of attacks flying around the place. It's kind of hard to tell what's going on. And I think that one was on me too. It's not good at all. Savin's probably not doing well at all at this point, because... One of them's got seizure. The hope is that Edgar will carry me through the fight even if everybody else falls. Because he's got region, the noise blaster, and that's not doing anything. Who is this? I couldn't hear. Well, I'm glad all those wave cannons were on the left side of the screen. One of them, I think, got on off a confused though. Is Celeste still hanging in there? Cause I'm being, I'm very not confident about that right now. Yeah. Uh, I think if anyone's gonna revive her right now, it should be you, because I think Edgar's probably good on HP for the moment. Dang it. I can't hear, stop making noise. I'm not sure if Celeste will be able to stay on her feet. It would be nice if she did, though. For all I know, that just killed her. Good, she's not dead yet, although I probably should have held off on that attack until Sabin Mantra, just a thought. Hearing lots of attacks on the left side of the screen right now. Yeah, so let's probably died from some source. Or not. How'd Sabin beat her there? I thought for sure Sabin's Mantra would be too slow. Man, lots of wake cannon this time around. But Celeste is apparently still alive. I don't think she got feelered. Good, that's still on the left side. This is taking a while, partly because they didn't mega bolt themselves this time. Whenever that happens, the battle goes a lot faster. Edgar's got his hands full, so even though he could theoretically do damage. Alright, so let's got feeler there. But I think I'm pretty much in the clear at this point. Yeah, that might nope, not the end. Well now is that the end? Yes, it's the end. Thank you. Now I'm still running upwards. Whoops. Item. Nope, Seven didn't get offed at the last second or something weird. Pretty sure that wasn't the case, given that none of the enemies can zombify, but, you know, whatever. Skills, less magic, cure... Cure the everybody, and wow, the everybody needed a lot of cure. Continue running upwards. Right one. Top of the bridge. Top of the morning to you. And then, it's not even the morning, it's like 11 o no, 10 o'clock at night here. <laughs> up is always safe, so if I go up after the fight, if there is a fight, there is a fight. <laughs> Alright, uh, safer option is Noise Blaster. I don't remember whether I already said that on this run, but... Might as well aura bolt for whatever it's worth. 
considering the enemies haven't even attacked me yet, and it doesn't even move my cursor. What is that that I keep throwing things at? I know there's an Ouroboros in this fight anyway, so... No, wait. This is... Maybe she does target the witch first. It didn't seem like it. Now you can start healing, because if Celeste got hit by rage, she probably needs it. Dead. Oh, that guy's dead too. Chainsaw's face? Must be a side attack because I heard somebody on the left get hit. Maybe the side attack is what threw my cursor off. Although, two times in a row? This is starting to mess with me. Better make it this time. So otherwise, I'm gonna go insane, I think. I don't think anything happened there. But it's easy for Petrify to slip through my guard, so... Because that one's hard to hear, and indeed it might have, so... I'm glad I'm paranoid. Uh, although, technically, it wouldn't have mattered, because I'd be going to skills anyway. Oh, no, wait. Raze hit her. Duh. Raze. It was Raze. Skills, Celeste, Magic, Cure... Wouldn't have wanted to be running around with poison on, that's for sure. And... Yeah, that's it. Don't know what I was doing. Up, left, up, left, up, left. I should be really close now, because that up and left stretch was not long at all. In fact, I was fairly surprised to get a battle there. I want to line her up to begin with, as well as get as far ahead as possible, in case I mess up the second re-equip, because this team will be equipped enough to possibly make it through a fight, but I want to limit the number of fights, so. So that's it for that. Now for the worrying part. Line myself up with save, make sure my a cursor is on the first character, skills, Sabin. Esper's still, I'm pretty sure. De-equip Stray? At least I'll be able to tell if Stray is improperly de-equipped. It should be a lifesaver. Uh, equip? Seven. As for anything else, though. So. And I'll shut up now, because I don't want to mess it up. I know I've messed up menuing the past because I've been talking too much. Relic? Tiger Mask, Dark Gear. Enter the menu again. Equip, Edgar, Remove, Flame Shield, Diamond Helm, Crystal Mail. Equip, Celeste, Remove, uh, Genji Helm, Force Armor. Relic, Sabin, Remove, Second Slot first, just in case. I'm not 100% sure if it makes a difference. Relic, Edgar, Remove, just the top slot. Alright, now if that all went fine, it hopefully did, switch to the other team and get them re-equipped as well. Fortunately, I've got to go through this process a couple more times, but... The other two times will be a little bit less dangerous, because if I fail now, I'm almost certainly done for, but if I fail later, it might be okay. Equip, skills, item, save. Skills. Oops, don't want to do that yet. Item. Line up my cursor properly on the top character. Skills. Gao. There we go, Stray. Equip. Gao. Equip. Top. Bottom. Top. 
Equip. Cyan. Equip. Diamond Helmet's one from the top. Uh, Crystal Mail's at the top. You may notice, but I sold, sold a whole bunch of stuff to make this a little bit easier. I sold all the junk just to get it out of my inventory. I didn't even need the money, but it made me tell 12,000 gil in the process, so I'm not going to complain. Setzer. Equip. He's already got the Crystal Shield, so... The helmet... The Genji helmet is at the top. And the Force Armor is there. At the bottom. <laughs> Some things... The Force Armor in particular show up in weird places on different equips if I didn't sell those things. But this way, all my equipping is... My three equipping rounds are fairly similar, whereas otherwise... They... I actually have to memorize three different sets of equipment, which is a lot worse. Relic. Back down to Gao. Equip. Top slot. Bottom thing. Bottom thing. Relic. Cyan. Equip. Top slot. Bottom thing. Alright, now if I make it to the switch at the end of this team's run, I'm hopefully home free. But if I die before then, well, I'm definitely not home free. That's for the very least. Up and left. Left is the safe option here. So yeah, probably no one catches there. It wasn't a long walk, so I'm not entirely surprised, but... Down. Left into the hole. Whee! Boom! Uh... Yep. That's not a thing. I forgot where my cursor was, so I just decided to do that. Cyan's kind of like my out of battle healer. Skills, Cyan, Magic, Cure... It's not a disaster if he runs out, though. All the way right. All the way down. Man, this team's going places, really. Um, I made a route change here for my BFLG. I'm not sure what I was thinking there. Left, up, left, up, left. Alright, up is probably the safe option now. Okay, so who comes up first? Dang it, where were the- oh wait, I think the cursors were set when I changed parties. I really should have looked into this, that was dumb. <laughs> Tight. All right, so this is Cyan. I want him to use a uh, economizer. That's not it. Empower right away because uh, he's probably low on MP right now. One, two, three. Maybe I got it that time. I might still have been a little fast. Good, got it. I'll hold the button down so Setzer will use H bomb if he's his slots are egged, egged, rigged to work. Quasar's not so good, not for this team, that's for sure. I think I'll use some power again. One, two, three. Empower. Cyan's probably the least tanky of this group, so using empower if I'm even at halfway concerned. Okay, now I'm not really halfway concerned, but whatever. And when I mess it up, I think the most likely thing for me to do is Mind Blow, although Quadra Slam is okay. Refract. That'll make uh, Mega Volt reflect on my own team, which isn't so great. Uh, should've been holding a button there. Alright, I'm gonna Mind Blow this time, I think. Once something comes up. That's interesting. One, 
two. Just mind blow what's ever left. Hopefully it's a revenant if there is anything left at all. I guess that was a death counter. All this team survived their inaugural encounter. Better do my double checking because there's a person vulnerable in this team too. Didn't think so, but it never hurts because that petrify is really hard to hear. Skills, cyan, magic, cure. Didn't need much of that. That encounter was garbage, apparently. There we go. Now time to grab that wing edge that I can't use yet. I've also got that rogue cloak that I can't use yet. That's wonderful. Actually, wait, Celeste can use the wing edge, can't she? In place of that rising sun. Whatever. It's not part of my plan, so I really can't do anything with it. All the way down. This is a bit of a route change. Oh, wow. Encounter. This is probably in the second room. So I want to use second room strats, which are exactly the same as the first room strats. Good for me! That's not so good. Adamantite. The nice thing about Adamantite is that it nullifies thunder, which is really, really nice down here. It's why I'm using it instead of Stray Cat, because it's so much safer. Uh, so Cyan. One, two. Maybe even been a little slow there, but I'm not even sure what I wanted to do, so... <laughs> they keep attacking Siam, which is not good, because he's the one who dies the most. But he's still alive. So maybe that depleted one of the sea flowers of its MP. Hold that button, I think I was too slow still. I need to pay more attention, really. One, two, three. Hey, something died. Not gonna complain. Okay, it's definitely five sea flowers. I'm surprised I haven't been shredded more than I have by now. Yeah, he used in power. At least Cyan's at okay HP right now. Gao's not gonna be hurt. And Setsu's still okay, too, so... One, two, three. Setsu just owned them, so, you know... That's the end of that. This team actually does very nicely with that Sea Flower counter the other team struggles with. And also with the Aquila. But does slightly worse at the other encounters, I think. Still going down. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that would have been weird. Skills, cyan, magic, cure. Slow and steady wins the race in this dungeon. Don't panic, don't do anything stupid. And don't forget anything, because... <laughs> everything's kind of important. Brighten up. Have I made it to the right up part yet? I'm actually glad I didn't get an encounter there. I don't know where the safe spots are. I probably would have chosen right, but... Because I also wasn't paying attention either. I should have gone slower. But... Three to the left, same as science and power. One. Two. Three. All the way up to the top. And now this lines back up where my BFLLG was. Thankfully it gives me an indication when I... No, it doesn't give me an indication when I run across the rocks. That's unfortunate. Forgot that it didn't. Alright. Now, back one, and I'm in line with the BFLG now. Now I go in an S-shape. Right. Up. Right. Oh, dang it. 
Bad timing. Why do I even bother? I just press A with both of them. Uh, mind blow first, then empower. Um. One, two. It's one of these encounters. That's kind of safe, I guess. I don't know. My characters aren't super well protected. Watch, Cyan probably got hit by that too. Which would be really bad because he's not using Empower this turn. Well, that hit a Revenant, so maybe he got Revenge. Or maybe... That isn't even close to Revenge because Cyan... Someone else got hit by Raze and then Cyan just killed a random Revenant. Not everything has to be about justice, I guess. One, two, three. Oh well, dang, that got reflected. What an unfortunate turn of events. Hopefully Cyan will keep himself alive, maybe set some seizure while he's at it. Well, Megavolt probably did most of that, unless he hits the one that had Reflect on. Have we even heard any Psychonic yet? I'm surprised that I haven't gotten any. That's yeah, okay, everyone's probably doing just fine right now. One, two, three. Sam might not be doing so well after that fire. Oh, no, that's not good. Sam could definitely be doing badly now. If I don't hear him come up, he's probably... Well, now he's probably okay. This is taking a while because Gao is refusing to use Cyclonic. Where's Gao anyway? You're still alright, Gao, right? One, two, three. I'm not even sure, that might have been too slow, but I don't even care if it is. Quadra Slice would be perfectly fine right now. It would be acceptable, I wouldn't complain. More fire attacks, but I think I'm probably in the clear at this point. Maybe I should have used... whatever. Did that actually kill it, or was that just Seizure finishing something off? He, Zitzer was probably the one who killed the guy with Reflect. Actually, that was dumb. Uh, Phoenix down? Didn't think so. The t There was a point in the battle where I was worried somebody... where I was worried Cyan maybe a bit the bucket, but... It was definitely not at the end of the fight. Skills, Cyan, Magic, Cure... Eh, actually needed some healing though. Kinda surprises me. Yes, I do believe I hit the rocks properly because I tried to open my menu at the time when I thought I was crossing the rocks and it didn't open. Now backwards C-shape. Up. Now left back across the rocks. I'm not gonna check there. Don't see much of a point to doing that. Unless I messed up the backwards C shape, which would be very, very annoying. Now I just do uh, an L, except I run through it backwards. The L is forward, but I run through it back in a backwards direction from the way sane people draw it. Although I suppose there's at least one person in the world that writes a capital L that way, but I'm going to ignore that guy in the favor of science. Eh, there we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> Things have seemed to be going okay so far, crossing my fingers. So... Now I've got two more re-equips to do. It's annoying, but it's... I re really want to do it. <laughs> Wait, what was I doing? See, this is why I don't usually talk when I'm doing this. Line my cursor up with Celeste. Skills, Sabin, Espers. Is this an Esper menu? Wait a minute. I'm being an idiot. What on earth am I doing? I haven't switched parties. Line my cursor up with Cyan. 
because I haven't started de-equipping this team. Don't mess up now, me. Skills. Gao. I'm going to double check this just to be certain I didn't actually switch teams or something dumb like that. Uh, equip, Gao, remove, flame shield, tiger mask, dark gear. Equip, cyan, remove, diamond helm, crystal mail. Equip, setzer, remove, genji helm. I just know Admin's cringing every single time I say Genji, but I'm gonna still say Genji. Genji. Uh, I do equip the Force Armor as well. Relic. Gao. Remove. Bottom slot first. Remove again. Relic. Cyan, move, top slot only. Alright. It's back to this team. Why am I cursed up with Celeste? Skills, Savin, Espers, Rama fails, that guy fails, straight. Equip, Sabin, Equip, uh, Tiger Mask is in the bottom slot, Dark Gear is in the top. Same as before when I was equipping Gao. Equip, Edgar, Equip. Alright, this is the only weird one that doesn't match up between Gao and Edgar, because Edgar's got a whole pile of uh, weapons and Gao doesn't. Go down to the bottom and then go back up one. Technically, I could do the same thing for Gao, but it's... I mean, I'd just be going down one space and then up one space, so what's the point? And now I'm being an idiot and losing my position because I'm talking too much. Equip. Edgar. Equip. Helmet. Um, he wants the Diamond Helm, which is one from the top still. He wants the Crystal Mail, which is at the top. That's Edgar done. Equip. Sless. Equip. Down two. Uh, what does she want? She wants the uh, Genji Helm, which is at the top. Force Armor. Relic. Sabin. Equip. Top slot. Down to the bottom. Bottom slot. Down to the bottom as well. Relic. Edgar. Equip. Top slot. Down to the bottom. Okay then. Left one, up all the way. If I didn't mess up the re-equipping, the team can this team can handle encounter just as easily as it could before. If I did mess up the re-equipping, things could get hairy. But I didn't hear anything. I didn't feel anything wrong. Like, but I've been wrong before. Okay, this is a not lava room encounter. Oh man, gotta get my bearings. This is Celeste. Switching between teams. Does have some effect on me, I guess. Just in terms of confusing the crud out of me. At least it resets to my cursors to where to uh, default position. That's actually very nice of them because there's it would be a lot harder to remember after, you know. That's two down. This is going swimmingly. Wait, it's over? Guess it's three down! This is going even more swimmingly! Equip, skills, item, save. Item. Now I re-equipped myself for that one encounter. I almost needn't have bothered. I think I probably would have taken that with no equipment. <laughs> Just saying.
skills slash magic cure. <laughs> Didn't even need the healing. Continue going left, and now I should hopefully make it to the switch without a fight. Let's just inch closer. There we go. Oh boy, now for the joy of re-equipping myself again. Sorry that this point is probably a little bit boring, but... <laughs> Slow and steady wins the race sometimes, so... I could have yoloed it, I could have gone with the mediocre equipment on the other team, but at this point I'm like, mostly through the Phoenix Cave, I don't want to do that. So... I think this will be the longest stretch that any party has to go with a... Uh, without a re-equipping, so... I mean... This... I mean... Uh, that's not even at all what I meant to say. And I also forgot where my cursor was. I'll shut up now. Skills... Sabin... Esper still... Just gonna double check... Because a failure at re-equipping something else might be a mass scenario, but a failure at re-equipping my Esper could lose Gal permanent stat bonuses, so I don't want to do that. Equip, Sabin, Remove, Tiger Mask, Dark Gear, Equip, Edgar, Remove, Flame Shield, Diamond Helm, Crystal Mail. Equip, Slash, Remove, Genji Helm. Hey, I said it properly that time. Force Armor. <laughs> I'm also making an effort to not exit the menu entirely every single time. Relic, Sabin, Remove, Bottom Slot first. Relic, that guy, top slot. Switch to the other party. Equip, skills, item, save. Cursor is on Cyan. Skills, down to Gao, Espers. Go back in. <laughs> equip. Gal. Equip. Top. Bottom. Top. Equip. Cyan. Equip. Diamond Helmet's one from the top. Crystal Mail's at the top. Equip. Setzer. Equip. Uh, Junji Helm at the top, Force Armor there. Relic, Gao, Equip, Top Slot, down to the bottom, Bottom Slot, down to the bottom. Equip, Top Slot, down to the bottom. I went through a lot of uh, effort to try and make the re-equipping as painless as possible. B. By basically just selling all that junk that was messing it up and making sure the ribbon and the light bell end up at the bottom. Only de equip what I need to de equip because that definitely makes it faster. Huh, that was probably the longest stretch of it. Almost be a shame if this team doesn't get a single paddle at all. But, at the same time, it would mean that I'm already at the save point, which would be super nice. So yeah, I think I made it through that stretch. It's the longest stretch, but it just gets more and more likely that I'll get a battle, so... All the way to the left? Oh, wow. Right away. I'm definitely in the uh, outer room, though. I say it's the outer room, even though... There's technically no way of saying. It's Gao. Who would have thought? 
One, two. There's a witch in the fight. The worst thing is a Mew, actually. Mews can be really dangerous with Thousand Needles. That can wipe a party member. And the double Mew witch battle is probably the most dangerous encounter here. And if it was a double Mew, Mew witch battle, then... Oh wait, it has to be. Crud. That's the last thing I want right now. Who are you? You are Setzer. That was Gao, which means Cyan got hit. Dry meat, Phoenix down. Get Cyan back on his feet. One thing died. They blocked that. Whatever that was. Oh, wait. What? Dried meat, Phoenix down. I think I accidentally phoenixed down Gao. That's... What the... Oh wait, Relic Ring. I can't revive him. He is the Relic Ring? I thought it was Setzer. Gosh dang it. I'm just gonna use slots. I'm starting to think it's a safer option at this point. There we go, Cyclonic. Hopefully that takes them both down to low so they die of seizure. Because I have no idea where Cyan's sitting right now, and that's not a good feeling. There we go. Whoops. Being an idiot again. Yeah, Cyan was dead. How would he end up with the Relic Ring? That makes no sense. Unless I'm way off base, but... Well, of course he's not. He was just dead. Skills, Cyan, Magic, Cure. My setup is definitely borked, which means I really, really don't want to get another encounter. Hopefully I make it, but I've still got enough distance to go that it's not completely out of the question to get a second encounter. But, I mean, that was the most dangerous encounter in the dungeon for this team, and I just beat it, so... Your mileage may vary. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, hey, it only took 56 minutes. whoop de do. Oh, boy. So, let's see what everyone ended up with, just for funsies. Or what? Everyone seems to have the right stuff. I mean... How was I missing... Oh, shoot, I forgot the order of my party. I was trying to revive Gao. Well, that's... That's a dumb thing. Let's just save the game. Uh, save. It's one of these safety states I dump everywhere. And see you No, it's not see you next time yet. I'm gonna get to the Red Dragon in this recording. Well, let's hope that nonsense doesn't happen again. All the way up to the top. Uh, two to the right. All the way up to the top again. At least no battles where I got one last time. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Skills, less magic, cure. Gotta take that hit, but it makes things somewhat easier, so whatever. And it's right next to the start of the segment, so it's not too risky. He starts not too bad if something goes wrong. So yeah, no more equipping on camera for the rest of the dungeon, which is nice. I've already had three more than I'd like, but... Actually, two more than I like. One is okay. But three, especially when it's practically the same, is quite excessive. But, wow, still no encounters at all? Pretty sure I've made it by now. So, back one, onto the bridge. Still no encounters, so... Back one, onto the bridge. 
Still no encounters. Back one, onto the bridge. Okay. Oh, it's Edgar. That's kind of surprising. Uh, what was that? Claw noise. What is that? Could that have been Petrify? It's the only thing I can think of. Or Feeler, maybe. Noise blast to their faces. Okay, uh, maybe it was Evil Dead, then. Well, I better take uh, Celeste off that zombie status, and that Noise Blaster probably did nothing. Oh gosh, she might be massacring my team so bad. Uh, I have to check who this is, otherwise this is worthless. Yes, it's Edgar. One, uh, Dried Meat, Phoenix Down, Revivify. Five if I Celeste. So she's not attacking my own team. She probably killed Sabin too. Not even sure what, if that did anything important. Well, Celeste is probably dead now, but at least she's not killing me. Debilitator Sabin. Hopefully he can keep my team alive a little bit. Although maybe Celeste would have been the better option. It's hard to tell. I'm always scared when I hear Debilitator. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's multi-target Gigavolt. I'm dead. Oh, well, I guess it must be Joker W.E. Dealers and that... Okay, this is Sabin. Hopefully he'll hit a Weedula. I'm just going to use Aura Bolt here. Debilitator on Celeste to get her back on her feet as well. If he hits the Joker, it's probably useless since he's already on Confused. That sounded like a Weedula, because close enough to the center, the Rain Man's all the way on the left side. What? This, next time I'll have Edgar use the Chainsaw. I'll wait for Edgar to go first, that way I don't kill the Rain Man and get quaked, because that would be bad right now. Chainsaw, Ruburos, and then you can attack the Joker. Not a Rain Man, he doesn't rain on anything. What? Oh no, you gotta be kidding me, not again. This is Sabin this time. Dried Meat, Phoenix Down, Revive Fi. At least this garbage wasn't happening before. Would have been much worse on a longer on the longer run, but and now she finishes him off, or not? I thought that would be a finish him off, but apparently not. Sus is probably dead again. Wait, what? I don't care. Just finish everything, Edgar. I don't know what's going on, so I'm definitely going to have to do all my checks this time around. Phoenix down, nobody died. Celeste was not on zombie at the end. Uh, Celeste was not on anything at the end. Skill, Celeste, magic, cure. Everyone sure need a lot of healing, though. left, all the way up, and this should take me straight out of this room, so that I can just hit the switch and then the se mini segment's almost over, because all I've got to do after that is run down. Alright, back out, two to the left, oh good. I want at least a couple encounters so that hopefully Edgar can gain another level. Ah, uh, this is Celeste. Wait. Yeah, that's probably okay. Okay, this is Sabin. Celeste just m absolutely murdered a witch. 
and Chainsaw. Those two should be at decent HP even if 7 isn't. One thing that's nice about my compact 3 person party is that Mantra does a little bit more in terms of rekilling the party in some circumstances. It's a lot beefier on 7, I mean on Celeste and Edgar. Of course, sometimes it's Sabin that needs the healing, and then, then it's just wasteful. Oh, battle's not over yet? I think it's just a revenant sitting there at this point. And my characters are probably at full of, well, they were at full if not close to it. Save item. No one's dead. That would be really shocking, actually, if someone had actually died. Skills less magic cure. Didn't even need much of that, apparently. Couple to the left. There's the base switch. Hooray! We doused the lava, apparently. And got rid of the other water on our way, so... That's nice, too. Then you check over, and then run all the way down. No, no other battle. It's gonna have to be the end of that, then. Hopefully Team CES gets one more battle. I think that'll probably be enough for Edgar to level if he hasn't already. That's the end of that segment. Over an hour total for you guys, so... <laughs> pretty long. But, it's not like I have much of a choice. I can't really do it any faster. See you next time. Yeah, I messed up. Still got one more part to do. <laughs> Still gotta get over to the Red Dragon. Whoops, why did I do that? That was a waste of time. One, two, three, four, five. All the way to the right. Dang it, that's not good. This is Gao. Set him up with that Animantite. That might have been too fast. Hopefully it wasn't. Just gotta steamroll these dudes and... Okay, wasn't too fast, good. It happened on the right side, so if there's a Mew, it might have hit the Mew. It certainly didn't hit that guy, though. One, two, three. Cyclonic, great. So they're probably mostly dead now. This battle's going... oops, what? Oh, this is Setzer. <laughs> One, two, three. Whatever, he got Lego Morph, that's pretty good. As long as it's not Chocobob. Chocobob sucks. Misses like half of everything. One, two, three. Oh, this is Sets again, I'm being an idiot. Whatever, battle's over. Don't care. Or not. Battle's not over, just do care. Yeah, Chocobob sucks so much killing all those enemies. Yeah, I never want to see it again. You know, a thousand needles, so that makes me happy. Skills, cyan, magic, cure. Okay, so that went fine. I want the other team to get an encounter, so I'm going to, uh... Have them go across this thing. So then I'm gonna switch back to the other team to hopefully manipulate an encounter with them. Right, down, all the way to the right. Alright, so now that'll hopefully be good. Other team, all the way down. 
left, down, left, down. Yes, perfect. I want Edgar to gain a level here, so... Oh, this is Edgar. Speak of the devil. Chainsaw. I might as well use Orbal. Down, down, left. Attack things, because that's what you're good at, Celeste. Just whacking things. Okay, so it's not an Aquila. That's nice to know. That was probably a Mew. If it died in one hit. It sounded like it was on the right side for some reason. Am I just mishearing things? Oh, Celeste just murdered something else. There we go. Another death. So that's probably the end of them. Oops. Being an idiot. Item save. Item. I didn't think so. Skills slash magic cure. There we go. Alright, switch back to the other team. Left, all the way down to the save point. Not done yet, just want to move this team a little bit closer, and hopefully the red dragon hasn't moved so far that he runs into me. Crossing my fingers here. Good enough. Okay. Let's not get too greedy here. Alright, so I think that went swimmingly. So, I guess I'll see you next time for real this time.